OPSI stands for the Oxford Brooks Social Entrepreneurship Awards and it's a program that we have developed to find, fund and support social entrepreneurs within the university ecosystem. That means between staff, graduates and current students. Last year 150 people signed up to the OBSI program and we were able to make 23 Triad awards up to £500 to investigate an idea. We then funded two Do It awards which were up to £5,000 to enable people to get started and lastly there were three Build It awards up to £15,000 for social enterprises that have been operating for a year or more to upscale their operations. It's called Oxford Art Circus and is a slightly different kind of art show. I really do kind of owe it all to the Social Entrepreneurship Awards because this was actually uh, something I had had in the, in the back of my head for a very long time. But there's no way on my income I could do this while also, you know, doing a master's degree and, you know, it's, it's impossible. But that amount of money made all the difference. In fact, I think we've, we've sort of barely gone over budget. This is done on a total shoestring and that itself has presented challenges and also opportunities. We've had to put in a lot more work and thought, but I think it's paid off by actually making us more conscious of how much money we're spending. And then, I mean, same goes for the support. It's just, it's been all along and from various people and I know that I would always have kind of a listening ear. I'd always have someone to go and ask. Um, or even to help us publicize it, which was also great. We have 20 or so incredible artists, and many of them are local, and, and are sort of itching for an opportunity to sell their work to a wider audience. And I think that you know, we as artists should be able to live off of the work that we do. I think it's important, and I also think many of us are priced completely out of the market, both as art appreciators and artists. It's incredibly nerve-wracking, but I keep telling myself every time I get nervous, I just remind myself of the artists, especially you know the ones that I've met and talked to, and their enthusiasm for the project, and the various people running workshops as well. I mean, that's that's what makes me <laughs> makes me feel like this is worth doing. I feel like I'm not standing up just representing myself; I'm representing them, which is really great. Yeah. What's amazing about this project in particular is it started with a funding of only £250 and look what they've managed to do. That's achievement in itself but it shows that frugal innovation can actually start quite small and the return is massive and it's not just about what's sold tonight, it's about actually contributing to community, activating artists and working together.